today I want to show you something super awesome. Okay, it's called Swido. Um, it is a solution that we use um, to essentially optimize campaigns um, at scale. So I will show you this uh, in detail. It's an all-in-one like reporting and monitoring slash optimization tool for Facebook ads. You can add your Google ads to it as well. Um, it's super user-friendly, game changer, absolute game changer for anyone looking to manage multiple ad accounts. The reason why I use it, I mean, they have reporting functionality, they have a bunch of other things, but really the reason I use it is due to the monitoring capabilities. So that's essentially a feature they offer where they can actually monitor all your accounts to see if those ad accounts are within KPI or not within KPI. And if they're not within KPI, uh, Swido will just give you a clean list of all the ad accounts, for example, today that are getting a CPL above, let's just say $20, right? Or whatever KPI you set. You set the KPI, so you can say, um, Swido, you know, any this for this ad account, for this campaign I'm attaching to Swido, um, does it, uh, I can't bring in leads for, let's just say, more than $10 according to the client arrangement. So with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and set the KPI in Swido such that it's only $10, right? And so with that being said, anytime it's outside of the $10 mark, uh, Swido is going to report that to you and let you know as the advertiser so that you can just see that right away. You don't have to sift in and out of 50 ad accounts or 100 ad accounts or however many clients you have. You can just go through it step by step. Um, so essentially, like, how does it really identify which, which ad accounts are not within KPI? It's going to aggregate all the important metrics and data um, into like easy to read reports. And then you just look at conversion rates, click through rates, um, you know, CPLs or whatever KPI you want to set. Um, in terms of the actual process of how that looks, um, I'll just show you that briefly here. So what you got here is, let's just say I go to KPI state bad. Now this is going to filter all of the clients currently that have a really high CPL in let's just say the last 30 days, seven days or whatever uh, period, I could say yesterday even. Um, and then you know to go to these client accounts, get in there and start to produce, um, start to produce uh, results for those clients that are already in a bad KPI, KPI state. So really what this does is it lets you reduce your labor costs as well because you, you can either run these ads yourself and then you just work with Swido and figure out which ones are in bad KPIs and then go ahead and revamp those campaigns constantly until they perform. Um, change the offers, change the creatives, change the copy, change the targeting, change everything. Um, that's one way to go about it. And then the second way to go about it is to have, let's just say, a full-time um, ad buyer. And that person, let's just say, is located in Brazil or Argentina or whatever it is, and they're running your ads full-time, and they, they are using Swido to manage 50, 100-plus accounts. Um, so with Swido, it allows one person to essentially manage a ton of volume when it comes to advertising. Because otherwise, if, this didn't, if you didn't have this, I'll explain to you what you're going to be doing. You're going to be going in and out of every single client's ad account on Facebook Ads Manager. Um, Facebook Ads Manager sometimes is, is slow loading, right? So like imagine you're just going every day through 50 plus ad accounts. Majority of your day is just switching through the ad accounts, right? Um, so which is really annoying to do. And I think that you can aggregate those statistics into one centralized dashboard filter by all the bad performing campaigns and then go ahead and make the adjustments required to actually get those campaigns to a better state. Like that is a much more efficient way to go about it. And I, and my ad buyer, he's spending anywhere between one and four hours a day, just simply going through the, um, just going through the bad KPI states. And then the rest of his day is just scaling, you know, existing campaigns that are performing. Right. So, the fact that you know which ad accounts need attention, it really allows you to allocate your resources wisely, which is key. Um, so instead of you know putting an equal time on each account, you don't necessarily need to put equal time into each account because if one account is clearly performing um, and producing leads at let's just say $4, um, you don't really need to like check in as much. Uh, sure, when the CPL starts to rise, you can refresh the campaign, but ultimately, 
what needs more of your attention is the is the campaigns producing leads at 30 40 50 dollars like those need to be changed right um and they need to be found fast and changed like quick right and sometimes like cpl states change because if you look at it over 30 days it might be a certain amount if you look over it over seven days it might have gotten better um so at least every week you should run even if you have a ad buyer you should have like a meeting with them just to go over the weekly improvements right uh, on CPLs um, so and and ultimately like you're really just increasing the chances you have to achieve success with this method um, because you know without the ability to know how each campaign is performing um, you're not going to be in a position to actually like pinpoint the problems fast enough um, and so listen Swido has some good insights it has you know some data driven stuff um, it helps you identify patterns. Um, it gets you, you know, into a position where you can, you know, build strategies that lead to success. Um, so yeah, so and s essentially, um, you, if you're running Facebook ads or Google ads, you're definitely going to want to be using this tool if you're running, let's just say 30, 40, 50 ad accounts plus. Um, this is definitely not something you're going to want if you have, let's just say five, 10 clients, that's fine. You can just go through, um, you know, the ads manager because um, it's easier. But with Swido, it's going to really make your process more efficient if you're dealing with 50, 60, 70 plus ad accounts, even even 30 plus, this, this should justify itself. Um, and the way they bill you is also based on how, how many data sources you're connecting. So the more ad accounts you connect to it for tracking purposes, um, the more it will cost. Now, we don't necessarily put in all of our campaigns. Like if our campaigns are evergreen and they're just working really well, we'll take them out of Swido. Um, just to save money on the software subscription so we don't have to like add like all of our data sources um, so and and keep in mind so it also comes with like other things like reporting you can do a lot of reporting you can create custom reports so for example I'll just choose a template and I'll just pick like a random client create report so this is a Facebook ads report that I can brand for myself like I can put my logo on it I can you know show the client you know literally all their statistics this is just going to be specific to Facebook, um, and then uh, it'll say it'll say which uh, you know which creatives are performing the best. Like it'll give them location summaries. Like it really does give them a comprehensive report. So this is a nice way to report to clients. You can create a PDF out of it. You know, put your logo in it. You can also schedule send it. So you can uh, basically. Um, so here it is. So here's the schedule email. So you can say, okay, every one week on Monday, send my client a PDF version of this report for the last seven days. Um, and it will just take care of your client reporting. So that's a nice feature about it. I'll be honest with you. I don't use this for reporting. I use uh, a different uh, solution for reporting. Um, but when it comes to this tool, we're using it primarily for the monitoring activity, which is going to allow us to now know which of our bad campaigns um, on, a, on a regular basis are uh, uh, underperforming such that we need to get to that and provide a solution as soon as possible. So listen guys, if you like this video, if you gain value from this, um, you can go ahead and click the link in the description. Um, I do offer one-on-one -on -one coaching. Um, I can help you scale up your business big time. Um, we've done it a lot. I mean, we have a lot of references, case studies. You can go on our website, check that out, variancemarketing.com. If you gained any value though, um, please just uh, subscribe, like the video, leave a comment. I'll be happy to answer any, any of your questions as it relates to any of this content. You guys have an amazing day. Make sure you crush it and don't take no for an answer. Um, it's time to level up this year. So you guys uh, make sure to like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, let's go kick some ass. So you guys have uh, a good week, great day, good life. See you in the next video.